I'm Senator Tony Avella, and I'm just going to speak a few minutes about uh, the bill that I introduced in the Senate, 4220, which would ban hydrofracking um, in New York State. And then I'm going to introduce a few speakers. You know, from my perspective, having served in the New York City Council for eight years and now my first term in the State Senate, whatever value some people may think that hydrofracking can place in terms of creating jobs, it is certainly not worth the risk of contaminating our water supply. Remember that the process involves, under high pressure, putting very toxic chemicals into the ground from which there is no way to recover this wastewater. All it will take is one accident, one scenario by which the groundwater ground is contaminated, and then we will never be able to get back the quality of water that we have now, which is obviously wins awards throughout the entire country. And being a state senator from New York City, New York City and its millions of residents are totally dependent on uh, upstate watersheds. When I was in the city council, I introduced the resolution asking the state legislature to ban this practice. The resolution didn't get passed. A similar resolution protecting just the watersheds got passed. But I had no idea that it would actually take my coming to, to the state senate, being elected to the state senate, to myself actually introduce the, the ban bill. We have a sponsor in the Assembly, Bill Colton. Um, my bill in the Senate now has a total of 18 sponsors. I believe Assemblyman Colton's bill in the Assembly has 16 sponsors. So we are moving ahead each and every day as more people learn how bad hydrofracking is and the potential for danger, the more and more people are signing on to this legislation. 